I'm going to talk about flash frying tips. We all love fried food and it's so easy to fry your favorite foods at home. It just takes a few simple techniques to get the perfect fry every single time. To get started, you'll want to make sure that you have the right oil. Using the right oil is so essential in your flash frying tips. You have to use an oil that has a really high heating temperature. So you'd want to use something like coconut oil or grapeseed oil or my favorite canola oil because it can heat at a really high temperature before it starts to smoke or burn. If you use something like an olive oil that has a low heating temperature, it's going to burn before you get that perfect flash frying finish. The other tip is to make sure that your oil is heated to a high enough degrees. You'll want to make sure that it's up to about 350 degrees on an oil thermometer. If you don't have an oil thermometer, there's a simple way for you to check. Just get a piece of bread and drop it in the oil. If the bread starts to bubble up really fast and turn brown, then you know that it's ready. If you drop the bread inside the oil and it just kind of sits there and it takes a while to start bubbling, then you know it's not ready and your food isn't going to flash fry well. It's actually going to get really soggy and it won't turn out well. The other tip for making sure that your flash frying is perfect every single time is the coating. You don't want a wet batter. So for most of my flash frying recipes, I like to dip my favorite snack in a little bit of flour, then I dip it in an egg mixture, and then I dip it in flour again. I wanna make sure that the egg is perfectly coated in flour the second time because then it gets that perfect crispy finish every single time. This is Mariko showing you flash frying tips. Enjoy. <music>